Derek Kuckelbarger. I'm the head basketball coach at Indiana University Kokomo. Over the past 15 years, I've served as assistant basketball coach to Harry Statham at McKendree University. I'm thrilled to hear that John McCarthy and Small College Basketball are creating the Harry Statham Coach of Impact Award. Over the past decade and a half, I've spent countless hours in gyms throughout the United States with Coach Statham. I'm very confident in saying that Coach Statham has had one of the most positive impacts of any coach at any level over the past half century. Countless times over the years, people would approach Coach Statham and thank him for his service to the game of basketball. Many times they would share a story of how he had had a profound impact on their life decades earlier. Each and every encounter over the years was positive and you could feel people's gratitude and appreciation for his leadership. So we decided to, uh, to uh, start the program the right way and uh, whatever it was, we're gonna, gonna, gonna do it the proper way and uh, win or lose, we'd do, it, we'd do it right. If we focus on his impact of his teams, I have a unique perspective as a former assistant coach. Coach Statham built his teams with far less talent revenue support, and national exposure than his Hall of Fame peers. His impact started with his philosophy. The relationships will, de will, will determine how successful you are, you are, you know, it's, it's about that. But we always want the you attitude, they're important, and honesty. And when players and coaches believe that you're honest and sincere, they open up and they get with you. And that's what we did, we, know, we, we did that. And, that's a highlight of my career is, is those relationships and uh, I've been with so many wonderful people. I mean, players, colleagues, you know, guys I look up to, but that's the, that's the, the beauty of it all, I think, is, is uh, relationships. Impacting people may be his greatest achievement. A champion of character who builds relationships of trust and respect. Coaching over a thousand players, teaching an additional thousand students, serving as athletic director and touching several thousand student athletes, as well as just being a friend to coaches. There's hundreds of relationships from middle school, high school, college, and even pro coaches that he really cherishes those relationships. Coach Statham is a champion in sport and in life. We want number one uh, players that had high character, that were going to do a great job off the court and on the court. Number two, a good student so they would be eligible and then graduate. And then third was basketball ability. So that's how we, we started that process. One of the things that I am most proud of Coach Statham for is the fact that his greatest impact on the game of basketball was not in his 1,100 plus wins he garnered throughout his career, but it was in the way he ran his program. Coach Statham valued character, ethics, and loyalty ahead of individual ability and talent. His teams consistently won more with less because he created a culture of trust and tremendous team chemistry. Harry and I became good friends when we were in grade school. He moved next door to me, and we've been friends for about 70 years now. And Harry is a, a wonderful person, a good man. And Harry and I used to play ball together as kids. Well, as we got older, we played ball together all through school. And in 1955, I decided to attend McHenry College. And Harry was getting ready to go to college in Oklahoma. And I asked Harry, I said, Harry, come and go to college with me at McHenry. And Harry, Harry decided to do that. And of course, the rest is history. We know that now. And Harry and I became good friends. And we've been good friends ever since. And uh, I, I just want to say that uh, we're, we at Brookport here, Brookport, Illinois, our hometown, we're very proud of Harry. We want to thank the people for making this coaching award in his name. And we want to invite you here. The gym that Harry played in in high school has now been given to the Betterment Committee here in Brookport. And the Betterment Committee has raised money and refurbished the gym and fixed it up real nice and it's going to be dedicated September the 22nd to Harry Statham. And if you're in this area, we would love for you to come and visit with us. And once again, the people of Bookport want to thank you all for making this coaching award available. 
A lot of people in my family have gone to McHenry, so I decided I'm going to stay home. And that's how I met Coach. That first time I saw him, he had a crew cut, white socks, he looked like a drill sergeant, and uh, he's no-nonsense kind of a guy. And uh, we quickly learned what we have to do to compete, to get some, some playing time, and uh, that, was our, that was our start. My favorite quotation is by Freeman. If you want to know the value of an individual, don't look to the sum of all that he owns, but look instead to the total of all that he has given. The quotation by Freeman is the best example that anyone could use for gentleman, coach, Harry Statham. He is truly an outstanding person and coach who made numerous and positive impacts on students and faculty and friends and college coaches. He helped sustain and build college basketball. Extremely disciplined, he works out every day. He's probably in better shape than, than most of us who are 20 years younger than coach. Uh, so just, he's the most disciplined man I think I've ever been around. And I think that played out in how he coached the game. Well, certainly he had an impact on, on players and, and, and other coaches. And I think it's our responsibility to do positive things, you know, and, and be sure that the player is prepared for everything. And uh, a lot of that decision making, I think, um, that's the single most important thing is decision making. Um, and so many times they're insignificant and sometimes they're life changing. And we always use the stay out of the gray area analogy that. If you're not sure, don't do it. And uh, you can build, you know, spend years to build a reputation and one bad choice can ruin it all. So that was always important to, to, you know, to, to be sure what you're doing.